It is Friday. You know what that means. It's time for the NPL Video Game Club. On this Friday, August the 25th of 2023. Already almost done with another month. Hope you're having a good week thus far. And hope it's a good start to your weekend. So thank you, E.C. Myers and Henry. Happy Friday to you. Oh, no, I, I wouldn't be worthy of saying that line, Henry, but uh, sad news in the wrestling world, indeed. Uh, my condolences to the family of Wyndham Rotunda, a.k.a. Bray Wyatt. Very, uh, very tough week for wrestling fans across the world. But nonetheless, their legacy lives on in infamy, and hopefully future generations to come will be able to enjoy his work as well as all of those who have passed uh, from this mortal coil. But nonetheless, the show must go on as it does in wrestling. So as always, your host here, Aldo, hope you're having a, again, a good week. And thank you for stopping by the little tiny corner of the internet that is the NPO Video Game Club. And look at that, the chat works. I didn't even have to sign into Streamlabs this time. It's... <clears throat> You flip a coin on when it decides to work or when it doesn't. But nonetheless, without further ado, let me begin with the orders of business for this week. So the Children's Summer Reading Challenge is going on until tomorrow. Wraps up tomorrow. I will link a pay a, a I will post a link to the summer reading page. Even though there's one day left, there's still time to enter. So if you have a child in the Norwalk or Fairfield County area. If you have a library card with us at NPL, all you need to do is go to the page, print out a reading log, and if your child has a book, or if you've had your child been, has been reading books at the library, uh, they are still eligible to be put into the log. We'll jot them down in the log and then hand it in over to the children's department, which is over on the second floor of the library, and then they receive a prize. So, you know, reading does have its rewards. So again, tomorrow will be the final day of the challenge itself. Best of luck to everyone who entered, and congratulations in advance to everyone who has decided to challenge their mind by reading some books. All right, and the Seed Library, as I've been mentioning the past couple of weeks, is open here at NPL. All you need to do, if you have a library card, just walk on over to Studio One. And then once you go to Studio One, you will see a giant little cabinet with a bunch of seeds. So all you need to do is fill out a little sheet of paper to uh, signify that you are taking out some seeds. And then there's a whole variety of seeds to choose from, from vegetables, herbs, uh, seasoning, spices, things like that. A lot of things you can cultivate, and these are all free. All we ask is that you just limit your variety to one packet per. So, you know, if you're taking, let's say, a packet of tomatoes, please just limit it to just one. Uh, there are plenty of things to choose from, and if you were just starting off your gardening journey, all you need to do is click on the link that I just posted, which is bring you to the gardening page, which is kind of a uh, HQ of sorts. If you were just starting off your gardening journey, it gives you some tips, tricks, information, uh, tutorials, how-tos, things to get you going, to get you started along on your journey of cultivating seeds. This is yet another free resource offered here at the library. So please take on advantage if you can, or if you are able to. Why not, right? And tomorrow, this weekend, Hartford, Connecticut is hosting Retro World Expo 2023. This will be tomorrow, the 26th, and also Sunday, the 27th. It'll be taking place at the Connecticut Convention Center in Hartford. What is Retro World Expo? Well, it is a giant, probably the largest video game themed expo in Connecticut. This was been going on for, ooh, I, I'd like to say since 2015. I Don't quote me though, but it's been going on for a while, almost 10 years. And it is a, a fantastic show. Think of it as a giant Giant, giant flea market, swap meet, a whole bunch of vendors going to be there selling a whole bunch of things from 
video games to action figures to statues to arcade cabinets to art to uh you know voice actors will be there uh you know they'll even have wrestling they, they've had wrestling the past couple of years there's live wrestling matches uh, right on the show floor and uh, just a little bit of everything it's a, it's a family friendly event all ages are welcome fantastic show hosted by some fantastic folks which i know personally so if you can uh support please do i wish i could be there uh, I, I did have plans to be there this weekend um things have come up uh, where unfortunately i can't make the trip down if if there is a small chance that i am there if i can somehow make it it might be on sunday but even then it's uh, i wouldn't i wouldn't bet on myself going unfortunately i've been to every year uh since but you know sometimes life gets in the way so you know can't be helped but nonetheless if you do happen to have a chance or are open on this weekend please consider checking out retro world expo over in hartford connecticut what am I playing today? Well, if you saw the, the description, uh, I am continuing on my quest here with the messenger. Been playing this for the past couple weeks. And yeah, uh, been doing that for a while. And I'm making progress. So last week, I am now kind of like in a free roam section of the game where I can revisit places that I was into in the past. But now something new has opened up. My new objective is to collect musical notes. I believe I need to collect six. I've found two thus far. So, uh, I think two. Or at least one, for sure. But, uh, yeah, I've got to backtrack and find these new areas and unlock the musical notes. And actually, you know what? Before I uh, begin, I, I, I forgot about something else. Whoops. I have an event. So my little event, I'll go for Swap Meet, which is uh, based on the Sega Saturn. If you haven't or are not familiar with that uh, console, it was a console that came out right around the same time in the mid-90s, around the same era as the PlayStation 1. Uh, so it was a very fantastic console. Uh, I love it. Fortunately, it didn't really gain a, a ton of traction here in the U.S., but it is very fondly remembered for having a fantastic library of games, from RPGs to shmups to fighting games, platformers, and yeah, if you are interested in uh, I'll Go Four, so that is the theme for my swap meet, which will be happening on Saturday, October 21st. It'll be from noon to 5 p.m. at NPL over on the second floor in the auditorium. I have linked a link to the discord there is an official algo discord so this weekend i'll actually be dropping the link to sign up as a vendor if you're looking to get a table to sell some stuff at my event i will have that open starting this weekend so sometime tomorrow i'll open that link it'll be live if you are interested in checking it out it'll also be placed over on the discord and if you have any questions for me about the event or any inquiries about how it works you could feel free to shoot me a message over on Discord. Again, yeah, that'll be in October. With that said, let me do the switcheroo here. And, and look at that. See, the chat did not show up. So now I need to refresh the cache. And then log in, log out. Glad to see you enjoy. Yeah, it, it is a trip. I, I do wonder what the length of the game is, though. It, does seem to be pretty long, especially considering it's a 2D platformer. I don't mind it, but I know, like, usually with streaming, you know, sometimes people uh, don't like games that take too long because then it would take too many, like, streaming sessions to get it done. I'm not of that mindset. I mean, as long as it takes, I'm okay with it, but others are not. So, uh, we mind it. See? Henry minds it. See, I don't even know why Henry's here. He should have, he should have left a long time ago. But he is here. I guess he's a glutton for punishment. <laughs> but nonetheless, thank you for sticking along, even if you mind it. But uh, let me switch on over to the messenger here.
again, I am of a different generation. And I know, like, you know, we see Let's Plays and things like that. People, like, not... They'll condense things down. But hey, I like to collect stuff. I like to make sure I try to get 100%. As long as that takes, I'm okay with it. Um, unless, you know, you're vocal in the chat and say, shut this down. It sucks. You suck. Then yeah, I could, I could totally consider playing something else. But I figure I have made slow but steady progress here, I'd, I'd like to think. But maybe I'm wrong. Again, this is my first time playing, so I don't really have any uh, context behind how good or how bad I'm doing. Hey, Big Glitch 79, what's up, buddy? Happy Friday to you. Hope you are doing well. I know I spoke to you earlier, but uh, thank you. Enjoy your time at Retro World Expo. I'm so sorry. I can't, uh, I can't join you there. So is life. But uh, there is a small, 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 small out chance that I may... Sh be able to pop in for a quick second on Sunday, but nothing is written in stone. Uh, but I do hope you have a fantastic time. Hope you get to meet up with some peeps and uh, and enjoy. Get that Contra run in at the arcade. All right, so I left off in Autumn Hills, but I think I need to go back to the Tower of Time because I already got. Let me see, what's the button for the uh, map? Yeah. So there was one power scroll that I need to get, which is right there. Now the thing is, um, I can't get to that just yet. So I'm thinking maybe I need to go to the next place and maybe that'll open up the path that'll lead me there. Because uh, currently I can't even get to that bottom part. So, let's see, uh, I want to go back to the Tower of Time, and then I want to go to this portal, which I haven't been to yet. Because this is, where am I right now? This is Howling Grotto. See, there are power seals I haven't been to yet, so... Let me see what's over here. All right, let me refamiliarize myself with the buttons. All right. I hope the play choice this year has a better screw. Here's hoping. Here's hoping for sure. All right. There you go. So then here, uh, what is it? I can go up to the left or I can go to the right to get a power scroll or power seal. So the question is, where do I go? Um, that could lead me to Bamboo Creek. Going right would then lead me to, I guess, Autumn Hills. I think I'm, I'm looking at that correctly. Oh, wait, hold on. There's uh, three paths here. Hold on. Nope, 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 nope. That's not what I'm looking at. Uh Grotto. So, oh, the Quill Shroom Marsh, I think is what that is. So should I go left or should I go right? Uh, what do you think? Now see here, okay, so actually I can't even go right. I would need to switch to 8-bit mode because right now there's this wall right here. Now if I were to go 8-bit, I would then be able to, uh, to be able to, that wall would no longer be there, I'm assuming. So I can't even uh, do anything yet. Ah, uh, there's this guy. Uh, somehow he hit me. 
that's okay. Yes, sir. There you go. All right, so currently I can only go up. I need to uh, switch to be able to uh, to get anywhere else. So right now my only upgrade is the Demon's Bane, which I need 2,000 uh, time shards. I only have 108. So I need to go this way. And see there is a split over on the top. I can see there's a seam, which will then switch to 8-bit. All right, so. So now, if I go back, I might be able to, uh, oh, wait a minute, there's a power seal up here. Hmm. There is one up there. There's no way to uh, climb up. Look at that. Oh, come on. All right, so I guess that's not as easy as it's meant to be. But, we do that. And then I've got to use the fireballs to get up. Okay, so... The power seal is is blocked here, so then I would need to go 16-bit, I guess. Okay. Ah, I see. Okay, that's what it is. Also with the wall climbing skills? Oh, I wouldn't say that. Okay, here we go. So I have got to do the grapple. And then I've got to grab onto this. Right. And then make a leap between. Oh! He grappled, but he didn't keep on. 50 deaths. I've died 50 times so far. Okay. That's okay. Ugh, this skeleton guy. Hit detection on him is wonky sometimes. Alright, so he's collecting. That's okay. Okay. Try this again. There you go. Ooh. Oh, again. 
Yikes. All right. Okay, someone's watching, you can pretend there's input lag. All right, well, I'm not going to go with that excuse, but... That's possible. All right. So I want to stay 16-bit. Third time's a charm, right? All right, so I want to fall with, with enough time. There you go. All right, that's fine. I'll take the hit. Got the power seal. So where does this... Oh, wait a minute. This looks familiar. All right, so this will shoot me to another area. Another land, maybe. Okay. Or maybe not. All right, that's fine. Ah, okay. It's just around. Okay, okay. Now, do I want to continue going this way? Which would then lead me to... Uh, Bamboo Creek. <laughs> so, I guess... The idea... I, I got one power seal. So, then that leaves one more. Two out of three. So, what, what do you say? Should I continue going... To the left to go to Bamboo Creek? Or should I go and pursue the next power seal. Now, in order for me to reach the next power seal, I would need to switch to 8-bit mode. The 16-bit mode, it wasn't, uh, the path wasn't there. What do you say? I, I leave it in your hands, chat. Should I go try to get the other power seal? Or should I keep going this way, which might be where that musical note is, where I need to uh, progress the story? I would go for the power seal, that's just me. Got nothing to lose at this point except time. But what say you? So I'm pretty sure what I need to do is switch to 8-bit, then I make my way down, and then I should be, uh, I should be good to reach that area on the bottom right. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm going for it. Alright, here we go. Give it a whirl. There he goes. See? Uh, that'll bring me here. Yep. Does the shopkeeper say anything in 8-bit? I don't know. No. Okay. Just testing all possibilities here. Alright. Quickest way down would be here. Might as well get the shards while I'm here. Why not? There you go. So this should lead me up to the next area. The stalagmite. All right, this is a new area. Get rid of these guys. Get rid of him. 
One, two, three. Right. So this is new. This I haven't been to these areas yet. Okay. So then here, I would need to switch to 16-bit. So this will lead me to the power seal room. Okay. Two. There goes the bat. Bye. All right. So there should be... Ah, there it is. Change to 16-bit. So then now I need to make my way back down. But first... Switch back. Here you go. Gotcha. There you go. And now this path is now open up, but I want to hit the uh, checkpoint. Keep all my stuff. Switch on over here. Okay, power seal. Bunch of crushing walls. Watching you play through this is making me want to pick this back up and finish it. Although it's been so long, I might have to just start over to figure out what, where I was going. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay. So there's no safe space here. Any place is insta-death. I think maybe if you duck here, where those smashing, you'll, you'll be safe. So let me try that. Oh. Here we go. Aha. That's safe. Okay. Oh. There you go. As long as you know there's a safe spot down there, you're good to go. Okay, another power seal. Cool. That brings me back down. Very nice. Okay, so all the power seals uh, are collected in this area. Three out of three. So what I need to find, I guess, is the musical note, if there is one. Um, now, I guess let me check to see what's up here in 16-bit, because I haven't been through this area in 16-bit yet. So maybe the musical note is here to the right. I don't know. I know I have to play the DLC, but I'll have to reacquaint myself with the controls. I hear that. All right. Whoop. There you go. See, I haven't been to this area in 16 bits, so this is new. Aha, look at this. More time shards to get. Perfect. Okay, so I'm up here. I could drop down. Get him. Get him. Break through here. Just wait patiently. Cool. Alright, so... That's not a wall I can break, I don't think. Alright. 
sorry, the left bumper seems to be wonky here. All right, one, two, wizard man, and he died. Oh, and that was a wall I couldn't climb. That's on me. I wasn't really expecting you to fall in that pit. That's what I would have said if I had any faith in you. Oh, how nice. All right. There you go. Ouch. All right. Ooh, I don't want that. Want to stay in 16-bit. Uh, Get some health. go. Goes that. Gotta love the respawns. They come in clutch. Actually, what I could have done is I could have just uh, smashed that to break through. Oh well. Can I break this? No. Alright. Okay. And he's dead. Okay, so I have got to jump that way. But there looks like there's a wall I can break. No? Alright, never mind. So I need to do that. But see, there's another... No. All right, there's another checkpoint here. But uh, up to this point, the, uh, the merchants don't tell me anything anymore. Outside of things I need to upgrade, so... This could bring me to the other area, though. Quill Room Marsh. Quill Shroom Marsh, right? Yep. Quill Shroom, one out of three power seals. Alright. These guys... Looks like I could grab on to the top of that. Could go down too. There you go. Okay. I wonder. Oof. Ooh, all right, hold on. All right, this isn't looking too good. I, I think I can get up there, though.
I just have a feeling I can get up to this and climb. Nope, I can't. Alright, good thing I confirmed it. It looked like I could have climbed that, but I guess not. Alright, so I can go down. Waves and Games, what's up, buddy? Happy Friday to you. A <laughs> fearless gamer? Oh, I wouldn't go that far. But thank you. Alright, so... Ah, uh, there's health. There you go. Alright, can I get up here? Nope. But I can go down here. What is over here? Hmm. Right, there doesn't seem to be a power seal around here. But, let me see where this takes me. One, two, three... I could just throw a star at him. Checkpoint. This brings me up here. Okay. So this is going the other way. Am I going... Uh, I'm just trying to see where am I tracing... Oh, okay. This is just where I would be. Okay. Okay. So go up here. What advantage is there to being 8-bit here? Because I've been through all this. But maybe there is something here in 8-bit that I need to see. seal, but I already got that one. So that one's already done. Okay. You know, the funny thing is I don't see any uh, oh, power seal, power seal. Okay. I, ju I think I just gotta go uh 16 bit and see where I where I go. Green orbs remind me of Celeste jump reset mechanic. I need to place it. I have not played Celeste, so that is new to me. I have not played Celeste, yeah. Believe it or not. Alright, so I can jump up. So I just found out that these guys only jump when you jump. is uh, interesting and tricky. Get him. Get him. There's health. I don't need the health just yet, so it's I don't need it. So it's fine. One, two, three. Oh, 
this guy just wants to run into you. There's Birdman. You know what? He's scared. Get him. I wonder if Celeste is a game I could play on this. Whoa, he just jumped right through the wall. Look at that. What is up with that? Wait a minute, hold on here. Hmm. No, I don't think there's a way for me to uh, get up there. Oh, whoops. Jeez. Wait a minute. Hold on. There is a way. There is a way. Okay, hold on. Nope. Can't get up there. I tried. Ugh. These things attack through walls. Look at that. How cheap. Alright, some enemy just died off screen. There you go. There goes that bird. It's on Game Pass, which is why I finally played it. Ah, okay. You know, I had Game Pass uh, once upon a time, but it's been a long time, probably about a year since I've used Game Pass. Um, I was actually playing Gears of War 5 on it. Gears 5, what do you want to call it? Um, but then one day, it just wouldn't let me sign in anymore. And I tried and tried and tried. So I just gave up. I was like, alright, that's enough for you, Game Pass. Gotcha. All right, Go this way. All right, so this green stuff I can't hit. So I need to get inside. Again, I don't need to kill every enemy, That's but sometimes they give you health, so it helps. All right, so I can't, oh, can't climb up. This guy shoots his thing there. So if I go down. Watch out for that. That means I can't uh, beat that or get to the next screen. Oh, all right, all right. I can't progress. All right. All right, luckily regained my health. All right, so here... Power seal. Hmm. Okay, power seal, I need to go up and then down. I had it off for a while because I needed a break from punishing platformers. But it seems like it may be time. Okay. Oof. Oh, I'm just getting hit left and right. What is going on? Okay. You know what? Maybe I might get some health. Yep, I do. Alright. Checkpoint. Heal. Square pegs, what's up? Happy Friday to you. How are you today? All right, here you go. Power seal room. Uh, which I can't open. 
Ooh, I wonder. Okay, so I gotta keep going down. Okay, so this is a little gamut here, a little gauntlet. Timing with the uh, bracelet is key. So I want to. Oh boy. All right. There you go. It has a relaxing soundtrack, so you don't notice it took you 115 tries to beat the level. Ah, I see. What is up, Square Pegs? All right, do I do this? Yep, I, I need, I get a one-two shot. Oh, there we go. Right, one more hit and I am done. Can I do it? I did. Oof. All right, lucky, lucky. All right. That's kind of an unfair spawn, because it kind of brought me to a place where I was going to get hit no matter what. All right, so there's one more power seal to the right. But see, now the game is going to switch me to 8-bit. To, uh, which I don't think I'm going to be able to uh, to get past, so I don't know. But you know what I should do? I should do the checkpoint. Heal, at least up to that point. There you go. All right, so now I'm better equipped. Nothing here, right? Yep. All right, so here's the switch. Now, I thought of you recently. I played the demo of Lonely Mountains Downhill on Switch. Don't know if I would describe it as relaxing yet, but it was fun. Oh, you thought you were thinking about uh, Square Pegs? He has many fantastic videos on the Switch. Hold on, let me let this keep looping. Somehow I got hit. All right, here we go. So there's that, there's that. Bye. See, there's a tear right there. I wonder why... Hmm. Now, see, that would lead to another path, um, which I haven't been to. So, you know what? I guess I'm going to have to go up. And see what's going on here. Oh, you're kidding me. All right, so see how the path opens up now? So now I can see what's over here. This will be a path leading me somewhere. So now I can go left or I can go right. I don't think I can swim against the current. If I go straight, I'm able to see what's over here. Oh, this is the uh, catacombs, right? Alangrado. Okay. So this is this is a new passageway. Um, but Alangrado, I've already received everything. So I've been here. I've been to all this. So what's over here? Huh. Okay. So shortcut to Howling Grotto. I love Lonely Mountains Downhill. Played it on Game Pass. Absolutely brilliant little game. Ah, what's it about? What do you do in that game? 
Jay recommended it in one of his videos. Okay, yeah. Jay's recommendations are absolutely awesome. Okay, so I did not go up here before. Um, I'm wondering, like, is there a... Uh, once the bird returns to the nest, it shall learn the power of true sight. So it's telling me something about birds, right? So trees. Quill Shrew, it's got to be Quill Shrew Marsh because there's trees there and Autumn Hills. Or it could be Forlorn Temple too. Definitely not, or Bamboo Creek. But definitely not Howling Grotto. So I think I'm just going to go uh, keep going this way. You know what? Is there something up here? Yeah, I wouldn't put it past them to let you climb up one of these waterfalls. Nope. All right. I mean, it's what I would do. Okay. But now I can go right. And what is this? This is... Some area I haven't been to yet. So this is going to bring me down to the under the uh, demon area. So this is like uh, this is like Dark Souls, where all of the map is interconnected in some way, right? So that would bring me to Searing Crags. Searing Crags. All right. But I'm still not done in Quilshroom Marsh. There's still a power seal that I need to get, but at least I know there's a Quilshroom Marsh shortcut. But I want to wrap up my business here first. So let me uh, go back up. Look at him. He's trying to get me. Poor little guy. Alright, so... It's a downhill mountain biking game. Very good physics engine behind it with a solid level of challenge. Really fun. Okay. I dig that. Alright, so I've been here, done that with the, uh... With the 8-bit... But I'm thinking I need to switch back to 16-bit to progress with the last uh, power seal. What? Okay. That's a little silly that I got hit, but okay. All right. Almost brought my back to, but brought myself back to square one. There you go. Okay. Now this I've been to in in eight bit, but not sixteen bit. That doesn't work. Uh, 
Oh, you're kidding me. Hit detection, man. All right. All right, so I've been to all this in 8-bit before, but not 16-bit. So I should, hopefully, be able to get the... Uh, The other way. Now I need to duck so I don't get hit by the spikes. And then when this gets the peak, jump over. All right. Ugh, you're kidding me. The way these guys scurry is, is annoying. Okay, checkpoint. One, two. Hit him. Alright, power seal. So it's above the screen to the right. So something with these fairies. So I got I got to go around. Basically what what it's saying. All right. So somehow they will open up the path. I'm guessing. him. Hmm. My wife kept wincing every time my biker died. Ah. I love downtown biking games. I probably commented on Jay's video that I'd be interested in playing that one. Okay, nice. Well, thank you all for, for commenting on Jay's videos. That's really cool. It's awesome that, uh, you know, people can uh, express themselves in their community of choice. So that's that's really cool to hear. If anyone deserves some love, it's Jay. All right, so this is down, down. Ooh, there's really nothing for me to do here. How do I get over there? See, that brings me to a, a uh, 8-bit drop. Hmm. Would I need that to then come back up? I don't know how I would uh, traverse that jump, though. There's no uh, gap. Oh. I'd have to sail, and then just grapple. Like so. Like, right now. Grab on. Like that. Okay. Hit him. Oh, wait your turn. Everyone deserves some love. Absolutely. I appreciate the positivity. I appreciate it keeping things nice. One, two, three. There you go. Now see, they only jump when you jump.
That's what makes them so tricky. But thank you, Jay. You you are wonderful too. You are awesome. Alright, so I'm almost at a thousand time shards, and I think I need two thousand. Ooh, alright, quite a ways. Almost halfway there, I suppose. So this will then bring me to Searing Crags again. This is where I fought the boss. Um, ah, but see, there is a, a portal. First, let me see what's going on here. All right, before I do that, one place at a time. Uh, but wait a minute. What happens? Right? Then I gotta make my way back. I think is what I need to do. You may have won our duel, but my Quill Shroom will still try to get you. Okay. Because I only fought her in the 8-bit uh, era, she doesn't show up in 16-bit. Okay. Again, this guy only jumps when I jump. Watch out for the quicksand. Now, I was silly, and I guess in 16-bit it's harder to see. This is quicksand, so it's not an instant death if I touch it. I was under the impression in 16-bit that I would die, but it's easier for me to tell in 8-bit that it's not an instant death if I uh, touch the floor. Alright, so... And see, in 8-bit, there are platforms to help my jump. So not everything is as it seems. Right? Okay, so the... Power seal room will be around here. It would be right here. Now, I want to get rid of him. And I want to get that. Okay. So now that I have an understanding of how these little things work, I want to I want to have him reset. Cuz I'm going to need to jump off of him to get the height to go up there. All right, there we go. Ah. Alright. No. Why'd you do that? <laughs> Alright. Go back up. There you go. Oh, you're kidding me. There you go. Alright, so then I could jump up. So basically, I'm supposed to follow these guys. They allow me to pass. Ooh, this is tricky. So they give a platform there with no spikes. All right, so I've got to wait for them to, to crisscross, like so. And then, our seal. One hit means I'm dead. All right. I think the only way to do this is grapple. 
like so. Whew. All right. I have to go pick up my daughter. Have a fun stream and weekend. Well, thank you so much, EC Meyer. Same to you. Have a fantastic rest of your week. Have a good weekend. Thank you for sticking around. GG, thank you. Yeah, one shot. All right, so the power seal is mine. Very nice. Oh, boy. All right, there is a checkpoint right up here. So that means uh, three out of three, right? Three out of three power seals here. Um, but the thing is, okay, so... I don't know if there is a... Uh, bird's nest I don't know uh, quill shroom marsh prophecy once the bird returns to the nest it shall learn the power of true sight now I don't know if these portals open up um, maybe I have to go to these other areas and then find a merchant and then open it that way. That's probably what I need to do. So let me go ahead and do that. Uh, I'll be going this way. I have to make my way to the right. Okay. close. See, they only jump when you jump. So it's not as hard oh, as you would think. Okay, so I'm going to Searing Crags. I'm going to switch back to 16-bit. And then once here, I think I need to find a uh, merchant. And then that'll allow me to, uh, to travel back and forth freely. I'm thinking that's what's going on. Searing Crags. So there's two power seals left. Get my health back. All right, here you go. So here's where I could, uh, in theory, open up the portal, I think. At least I think so. Uh, unless there's another way to open up a portal, I, I'm not quite sure. It would be pretty bad if I didn't... Oh, I don't think I opened it. I didn't. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess I can go here then see what's going on here. This is the ice area. Glacial Peak. Okay.
Can't go that way. You know what? Let me let me get the uh, checkpoint first. Ten forty six. Can't do it. All right, so. I wonder what this is all about. Can I just go over? Nope. I was just curious to see if I can go to another area. Living outside of time, I tend to lose track. Have we met before from your perspective? Okay, so now I gotta make my way back down. But, if I go down this way... Not really a difference, so... A minor shortcut, if that. Oh, these Medusa head guys. Oh boy. They're just about the worst. Oh, you're kidding me. Alright, grab on. Deuce ahead, boys. Break through that, okay. Checkpoint. Okay, there could be a power seal here. But where? So it looks like there's a uh Path up. Have you noticed that on Fridays at work, things start popping up that need to be done just as you're preparing to leave and enjoy the weekend? So is life. Yep. That's the way things work. <laughs> Hopefully uh, you can you can get it done or, you know, wait for another day. Hope so. All right, so... I need to go down, switch screen, and then go up. Okay. Ooh, that was close. Okay. So this would be the power seal. All right. Gotcha. As you don't move, you're okay. All right. But it looks like I can actually drop down from here. There's no pit. So I'm going to try dropping down and see what happens. Drop down. Ooh. All right, luckily there's that. Uh, 
where can I go? I need to go down here. Checkpoint. There's that dragon. Okay. So this bat can uh, go through walls. Again, snowman. Hit them with a uh, with a projectile, if need be. I don't think I can go up there, but it doesn't hurt to look, right? All right. I don't know how you're supposed to make that jump. I think you were just supposed to take that hit. Alright, that's a pit. So I want to go this way. Alright, so I can either go to the right, or I can go down. Power seal down, and more power seals down. Ah, but yes. Definitely could use more time shards. Notice that there's uh, two people frozen in ice here. A uh, man and woman, it seems, holding swords. What's up with that? I did not notice that in 8-bit. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything to be had there. I should probably take the uh, checkpoint. 1260. Alright. Ah, see, there's a, uh, a link. So left is to that giant dragon. See, I, I've seen this before. I, I should be doing it in 16-bit. Oh boy. All right. I just messed myself up, didn't I? Manfred, what happened? Oh, it's the dragon. Hey, buddy. It's a long and embarrassing story. The elemental skylands are in danger. I need your help. The elemental skylands... Yeah, they regulate the climate in this little world of ours. If we don't take care of it soon, you'll find the demon curse to be the least of your concerns. Okay, I'll try to find some help. I'll be here. Alright, things have frozen over.
Manfred. Whatever shall we do, buddy? exactly is help, though. Uh, at least I'm getting health, so that's good. try to get me, but it's not going to work. Okay. Hit that. So I can go up. Yes, I couldn't do that in 8-bit. So that's the power seal. Gotcha. Alright, so what am I supposed to do? I needed to take his fireball and ride it. Okay. Oops. And he got me. I was supposed to ride the, uh... Oh, well. All right. Waves and games, please be safe. Have a fantastic weekend, buddy. Alright, so I'm supposed to ride this, is what I'm supposed to do. Or maybe not. Alright. Well, brute forced it. But got the seal. Alright, cool. So that leads me to uh, one more uh, power seal. Could drop down. I see there's a little jump there. Oh boy. Ooh, I almost died right there. Yow. I want to do that. What's that? Okay. Still need 2,000.
Now, I don't need it just now. I think the power seals are more pressing. All right, so go down. All right, so I can go down either way here. Aha, you see? Aha. This must be where it is. Yep. Okay. Oh boy. A lot of climbing. Okay. Whoop. Well. Who was that? Luckily, it's not a far uh, trip. Okay, so it is this way. Gates. All right. It's timing. Those drops are timing. Oh, hi. I'm Corbel's co-worker, Quibble. Apparently, I just had to see the face you make when you fall in a pit. Priceless indeed. All right. This one is tricky. It's got some weird timing on it. Yikes. Down to one hit. Well, it doesn't really matter because it's, it's. I'm gonna get hit anyways. Yep. Like so. One fall in the spikes a day keeps your spine not okay. If you guys could heal me, that'd be great. Oh, yikes, man. What is up with that? Wonder. There you go. Oh my god. It wasn't enough clearance to dive. Alright. Getting closer. So there's that. word. There we go. All right. Took one less hit. This is what you got to do. All right. Do it enough times, you figure it out. Is this power seal three out of three? Okay, so then I need to find help for uh, the dragon. But I already got I already got the power seals, so that's that. Searing crags would be back down there. So if I keep going down. Climb down to the Searing Crags. Sure. You didn't really climb, you just jumped. 
Oh, it's the ogres. I guess in the future they're dead. Okay, the plant. You got the power thistle. Time to prevent two dumb brothers from waiting to death. It will take a long time for anything to grow in there. Okay, so I need to give them that. And then maybe that cauldron can thaw the dragon out, I guess. Not quite sure. Alright, so there is... Two, there are two more power seals. One and two. Hmm. Can't really upgrade. The only upgrade is the thing up here. Okay. But, I guess... Hit him. Wait a minute, that looks like a wall I could break. Okay, this is balancing. Oh boy. All right. The drops are sudden. Nope. And I'm dead. You gotta get, gotta get each one. I wasn't really expecting you to fall in that pit. That's what I would have said if I had any faith in you. Okay. At least I can just get right to it. Yeah, thank you. That was luck. <laughs> but I'll take it. Power seal complete. Alrighty. That's great. Now, there's a whole other area down here. Now, what is this? I don't know what that leads down to, but... Okay, so this allows me to go back through uh, time. Okay, 
I found it. Just curious to see what's down here. It's all connected. Okay. Okay. So this is where I was before. I just didn't go through. Okay, so this is a... Yeah, this is very much like Dark Souls. Very interconnected map. So I at least could now, in the Tower of Time, I can go this way. Okay. I do wonder why one orb has been lit up here, and another one has not. Okay. Oh, Searing Crags. And that brings me back. But I want to keep going this way. So I need to go down, and there's the other power seal. All right. Look at that. Look at those evil guys popping out of nowhere. There's no real way to know they're going to appear. <laughs> they just appear whenever. All right. It's just a matter of keep going down. But since I was doing this 8-bit before, it's slightly different now. was a power seal room. Okay. Oh, wow. That clipped through the wall. That's... You're joking. I fall down. I should just do it here. That was close. Actually, do I go down? What is up here? Checkpoint? You know what, though? I don't know what's down there. Aha. Uh -huh. You know what? This was one room I couldn't get to before. I remember this room. Okay. 
But now I'm good. Alright, cool. I, re I remember that room from before. Alright, checkpoint. So now I could go up. Well, maybe not. It's, it's another place I need to drop down to. Okay. Into this already. so much for that. Power C. Okay, so I need to go down to the left. There's health, which is great. A drop here, which would then lead me to, yep. Okay. Power seal room it is. Duck, I should be fine. Duck, I should be fine. Can I duck on that? Yes, I can. Okay. Power seal. All right. So I have got to grapple. All right, that's fine. Whatever. kidding me. All right, good thing there's a uh, checkpoint right there. All right. Got it. Took the hits, but it's okay. Hopefully I heal up anyways. Yep. Alright, good. So I got all three. Three power seals there. One out of one. I need one more there. Forlorn Temple I haven't been to. Catacombs I haven't been to. Bamboo Creek. I got them all in 8-bit. Howling Grotto. Ghost Room. Searing Crags. Underworld. Glacial Peak. 
Cloud Ruins. Alright, so it's Autumn Hills, Forlorn, Catacombs, Underworld, and Cloud Ruins. So my nearest uh, exit would be going back up. Oh my word, you're kidding me. The bounce on that. <laughs> 20 power seals, holy smokes. Alright. Uh, oh, tower of time it is. Alright, so Glacial Peak, Searing Crags. This hasn't been opened. This hasn't been opened. So basically every location has a portal. It's just a matter of finding where that portal is. Which is strange because the, uh, the game doesn't really tell you. There's no visual indicator of it. Which kind of stinks. Um, so let's say I go here, which would be Searing Crags. No, the Howling Grotto. Now I could go to Bamboo Creek. I don't know. Depends on where I want to go, really. I mean, I, I didn't go all the way to the top left. I didn't do that. So maybe, maybe I could do that. Make my way up. Now, you know what? Let me give that a try. See this, if I have an 8-bit, there's another uh, path. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> got him with the spikes. Very nice. Sometimes happy accidents do happen. are annoying. No doubt about it. 
but what I want to do is I want to move to the top left. I want to try to get to Bamboo Creek. Because I have not seen that in 16-bit yet, so that would be a new area. There he goes. No, I don't want to go that way. Alright, so I want to keep going down. Oh my god, where did that skeleton just... Out of nowhere. Yes. All right. Drop down. Wait till he goes this way. Then I turn. Oh, I saw you. So I'd go up and around. So there's a trap there, but if I keep going, should be able to make it through. Yeah. So I need to instead I need to go around. Alright, so I need to jump off of him and get a boost. this, yep. Hmm. 
All right, this way. That brings me up. That brings me to Bamboo Creek. Perfect. I think I've been here with a 16-bit. Maybe I was? I, I don't remember. But I've got to find the portal that, uh, that gets me out of here. Or maybe there isn't a portal here. I have no idea. There's no way to tell, right? So that leads somewhere else. So I need to switch to 8-bit to be able to do that. And then now I can make that jump. Cutting through. Interesting. Okay. One, two. Ah, okay. Then I gotta go back. Clever, clever design. I, d I like that. <laughs> and I got that portal thing going. One, two, yeah. Yeah, there's no way for me to make that gap. All right. But then that brings me back to 16-bit. I see. Okay, so this is a new area of Bamboo Creek I haven't been to before. way there is all right there's more interesting okay aha okay shortcuts galore okay now where am i Oh, there's the guy. Bostro, I presume? The brother of the other guy at the bridge. Hey, that's such a cool sword. How did you end up trapped in here? Oh, the irony, right? 
It's a very embarrassing tale. I'd rather get back to my workstation. Thanks for snapping me out of it. And he just vanished. Okay. Okay, well, I, I got that, so that's something, right? Ah, but see, there's the underground. Catacombs, catacombs, which I haven't been to. 610, alright, so I need to find the next portal. And then retrace my steps, as it were. Which will be right here. Just keep climbing. Alright, it has saved. So I think I'm good. Oh, I'm almost at 2,000. Look at that. Almost at 2k. Ugh. So close. But yeah, so at this point... Uh, the underground... Where am I right now? Uh, I think I'm up here. So let me... Yeah, I'm over here. So I would need to make quite a trek to get to the catacombs. So I think... Uh, I think that's it for tonight. Um, yeah, because if I were to make any more headway, because if, if I go to the catacombs, I don't know where I would find a... Uh, a checkpoint and then that's a whole thing finding uh more power seals so so what is it that's uh was it one two three five eight eleven now this is interesting because it says in the shop i need more than eleven 20. Huh. Yeah, the, so I guess there's more in places that I'm not even shown yet. Okay. Well, as long as it saves. But uh, that will be it for the messenger tonight. I didn't find a music note, but I found uh, plenty of power seals, so there's that. That's progress in my mind. But uh, yeah, let me give a shout out to everyone who popped in today. EC Myers, thank you so much for stopping by. Henry, 8BitGlitch79, enjoy Retro World. Hope you have a fantastic time there. Have some fun. Waves and Games, thank you for stopping on by. Square pegs, Jay, as always, it's a pleasure. I appreciate it. And to anyone else who may have been lurking or just watched for a quick second, we really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, so, yes, as a reminder, Virtual World Expo is tomorrow and Sunday. So, this weekend, will be over in Hartford, the Connecticut Convention Center. If you are interested in checking out Virtual World Expo, I'm going to link again to their website. Uh, I'll put it in the chat. If you were interested, it's a fantastic time. Really cool stuff. Whole bunch of cool games. There's going to be music, bands, uh, YouTubers, wrestlers. It's just a, a big gamut of, of cool. So if you're in the area, check it out. You can get tickets at RetroWorldExpo.com. You can also get them at the door. Unfortunately, I won't be able to make it, but nonetheless, I hope everyone who is there has a good time. It has fun. But yeah, that is it for today. As always, hope you have a fantastic week. I will be here next Friday. We do this every week. Please be safe. Enjoy time with your family and friends and loved ones. Please be kind to one another. 
a bit of kindness goes such a long way in shaping and changing someone's day. And that is power. All right, so I will see you here next Friday, right here on the NPL YouTube channel. So long, everybody.